There we go. <laughs> yes! In the name of chaos, the end times are near! Alright. If I'm correct now, the mortal empire should be... Yes, thank you very much. So the Mortal Empires is basically the campaign from the first game, but then of course placed into the second game because they just needed to do that because the Vortex campaign is only meant for the, well, later down the line also fifth faction that they added, but it's not as important. Now the options of course are for me only very minimum, well, limited since it is only chaos, which includes of course the almighty Archaon the ever chosen Colex Sonita <laughs> and Zigfold the Magnificent I mean there's only one option here so what does this guy start with I mean come on I admit this dude's not too bad but I mean if you see how big this dude is, there is just no other option besides this guy. There is something though I need to check. I'm getting the feeling as if my graphics are. Eh. Yeah, okay, it seems. Okay, they're just doing a little... Okay. Just wanted to make sure that everything is set up right. Now let's kind of have some I fun. Tyrius, heir of yes, you're very great. If I cared even in the slightest. Like I said... Okay, his resolution is still not great, but we'll just have to deal with it. Okay, so this guy gets diplomatic relations... Okay. This guy... Dragon Ogre units, Dragon Ogre Shagoth, increased damage, and For this guy. Chaos. How is this guy part of Chaos, though? He looks a little too healthy for that. But this is the only option I have. I know that the initial challenge is hard, but that's kind of part of the point. I will keep the... I will set everything just easy to make it a little bit easier on myself, since I don't usually play Chaos. Okay, let's see what we start off with in additional Chaos Warriors with Halberds. That's pretty good. Anti-large. It's definitely going to help a bit. We've got Chaos Warriors with Armors and Shield and Dragon Ogres. Which makes sense considering this guy is a Dragon Ogre Shagoth. I mean, look at the... <laughs> look at that dude. <laughs> this is going to be... Probably going to end up horribly. Well, let's bring about the end of the world. I mean... It feels like one of those days. The storms gather, raging across the north, rousing the oldest of Shagoths. Kolek has awoken, and his anger is as fierce as he is ancient. Now is the time to honor the ancient pact made with the Chaos Gods. To wage endless war. For Kolek, Sun Eater, there is no mere minion of the ruinous powers, but the Herald of the Tempest. Yeah. Uh, when you got a dude who's about the same size as a fucking house... <laughs> I'm pretty sure he isn't just a rolly scrub <laughs> who sits at the bottom of the food chain of the chain of command. I've never played Chaos. It should be interesting. <laughs> Look at that fucking hammer! Will do. You shall go into the lands of the mortals to spread fear and destruction. The Norse tribes to the west shall fall easily before you. Find those willing to join your cause and slay the rest. Will do. Further to the south lie the nations of men. We'll get to that. They will resist your advance and for good reason. You will <laughs> so it's... So that's the Czech Republic over there. Devour the mortal souls to bring the favor of the Chaos Gods. March forth. And spread oblivion in their mind. Look at it. Doesn't that just look homely? So these guys don't build bases, though. Warriors of Chaos Hordes. The Warriors of Chaos cannot inhabit settlements. Instead, roaming the map as hordes in which encampment buildings may be constructed. Chaos Corruption. The followers of Chaos spread corruption where they pillage. 
It's and raid, despoiling the land and making it unsuitable for those who have not given themselves to the ruinous powers. Clink here. I have the general gist of it. All right, raids were sacked the following number of settlements, the pawn and all our pawns of chaos. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Okay, let's see what do we got here. So basically, we should start off with smacking into this camp over here. That would be the best option. I don't think it's a good idea to. So as far as I understand, now we have the donut involved as well, and there's pretty much just this. I don't think this guy has any other means of travel. So first, let's see what the troops comprise. Well, obviously, Codex Sun Eater. Got halberds, we got some standard Chaos Warriors, some Chaos Marauders, Marauder Horsemen, odd decision, Chaos Warhounds, some Dragon Ogres, and a Chaos Spawn. Eh, Chaos Spawn is maybe not. Uh, technology. Eh. The Path to Ruination, Casualty, Replenishment Rate, Dwarf Growth plus one. So, how does this guy work when it comes to his leveling. Well, I guess we'll get to that point eventually. I mean, look at him. Isn't he just beautiful? Channeling. Winds of Magic. Camp. Raid. March. Eh, we'll just take a wander. Yes! For corn! Well, that's pretty much all I can do for now. Diplomacy. Um, there will be no diplomacy. We are chaos. Diplomacy is not a thing we do. Yeah, there's a lot of factions to go through, so this could take a bit. There we go. Your kind of the will of the dark gods made manifest, my general. Harness the gifts afforded to you by the ruinous powers. You shall be unstoppable. Will do. The warriors of chaos seek nothing but to sow destruction among the mortal races in service to their dark gods. Their vast armies headed by the mightiest champions of chaos. March south from the frozen waste to slaughter and destroy. Lure. Well, why can't we just start with breaking some camps and, you know, ruining the place to begin with? Chaos corruption is already 100%. Maybe I'll just... Eh, this could be fun. Okay, let's first see how technology will do now. Scrutiny of the Dark Gods. Marauder units, income from post-battle loot. From raising settlements. Let's start with this one. Actually. There, that's probably best for now. <laughs> Declare war, obviously. Olaf Hilmarsson. Gorobmatni tribe, Norska. Eh. Then corn will reap your souls. Corn is with me, fool. Just to get the idea on how these these bastards fight, though, we're gonna have to do this deal. Okay, so these guys just have regular marauders. Let's have some fun. For corn. Corn with a K. I mean, the Warhammer universe is messed up as it is, in general, but th these guys, it just gets worse and worse. Okay, so let's see, what have we set up here? We've got our... Guys, I think you need bigger horses. So these are our horsemen. They're missile cavalry. Okay, that's interesting. War beasts. Dragon ogres. It's gonna be fun. Axe infantry. So these are the chaos spawns. Pleasant, pleasant looking fuckers. <laughs> what are they saying? Okay, so that's what we got here. So we got the cavalry in the front, some axe infantry, some beast war beasts, standard axe from chaos warriors. Hmm. They seem to be well dressed for the job. And if I'm correct, yep, there are the halberdiers and the rest. So, the troops over there, super there. 
I think I'll just, just for the shits and giggles of it, I'm gonna just charge straight into it. Right. I don't think this is gonna be an overly complicated situation, so let's just do this. They're gonna enjoy this. I mean, look at this dude. He just fucking is massive. I'm telling you, the dude's as big as a house. It's amazing. Let's get him! We're gonna just have him charge straight into the spears. We'll have the dogs have some fun. God, fucking look at this! Look at him go! <laughs> Holy! Look at this! Is this even a contest? Boof! This is, yep, <laughs> this was no contest, yep, I definitely put it on easy, but I don't give it to The corpses of the enemy lit in the ground, and those still able to flee do with the laughter of our gods ringing in their ears. FOR CORN! <laughs> God fucking damn it. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy this insanity. Ah. Oh. Mm, bit disappointed. Not enough casualties have been claimed. <laughs> Decisive victory. Yeah, there was a little bit of difference in uh, army strength. Waken tribes. Loot and raise. Raise. Destroying the area and the enemies has strengthened this horde. Um, I will loot and raise. Your warriors have raised an artifact of worship to the dark gods Ooh. in the rubble of this wretched place. It spreads the taint of chaos across the land, mighty lord, weakening the resolve of those that might stand against you. Well, there's frozen landing. We're gonna take care of some of the Norse tribes first, just to get into the swing of things. <laughs> Obviously, he. Mm hmm. So, an artifact, you say. I can't really turn it around. Ah, so they raise it there, so it causes the corruption stuff. Obviously. Alright, let's see. I have the gods, weapon strength, dominating presence. I think he's gone enough. Hearts of iron, vigor loss reduction, leadership, aura size, anything else in the interesting bit? Nope. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm just gonna go with Hearts of Iron. That seems like a lot of fun. Well, there's not much I can do with him this turn. Again, diplomacy will not be part of the job. Long victory, campaign victory. Razor sack the following number of settlements. 80, destroy the following factions. Ooh. And short campaign? Eh. 
We're just gonna see how long I can keep this shit, keep this steam train going. <laughs> All right, I think I'm done here. Let's see what else is on the menu. I mean, look at the bastard. He is. Just... Your warriors live their lives on the march, mighty lord. The hordes have no need for towns or cities. Nope. Praise all that you find in the name of the dark gods. All right. Well, it's not much else to march through into the next one. I don't think that's going to be too much of a problem. Let's go, boys! We have fun to perform! For corn! So, what is exactly the deal with Colex on Eater? To be honest, I, my Chaos lore is a little mm, non existent. I'm familiar with the Warhammer universe, and a lot of shit happens that's just missed up, but. To say that I'm an expert, there's probably people who can go through the entire thing from start to finish and not miss any details. I'm not one of those people, so I'm just going to enjoy wrecking shit and corrupting in the name of the Dark Gods of, and the Ruinous Powers. Yahoo. <laughs> to be honest though, living in the Warhammer universe, uh, well, in the fantasy world or the original... Um, or the Warhammer 40k universe. It's... I gotta be say, it's it's not a lot of fun. If you think about it, I mean, it's just... I mean, you're gonna die. That's without a question. And you, But the fact is, you're also gonna die horribly. The question only on that front is, in what kind of variation of horribly are you gonna die? Well, these guys are gonna figure it out firsthand, though. Ah, we finally have a little bit more of a fair fight. So I might actually have to do some thinking for a change. Balance of power. So he's nearby. Hmm. Oh well, let's just do it. He'll say he'll get some reinforcement, but I can think I, I think I can take care of this. The Shargos, uh, the Dragon Ogre, Koleg, and of course the Chaos Warriors will take the fr will take the brunt. The Marauders and such will take. Uh, well, actually, the Marauders should take the front along with the the Dragon Ogres as well as uh, Koleg, and then the Chaos Warriors will march in. I'll have the cavalry flank along with the War Beasts. This time around, I'm gonna have to play. The Okay, that's pretty much that set up. Chaos Spawn can go over here. Actually, then it's best to just put them together. Alrighty then, I think we're good. Let's hope this turns out better than I hope. What a blood god! Come on, Coleg, you're gonna go straight into the front of the, into the brand of it all. We're just gonna have him charge straight in. Get these guys into here. Send these guys into this flank. Have these guys charge into the center. 
And have these fuckers also just... I'm just gonna let Cole like do his thing. He knows what he's doing. Yeah, I know the Lord's in combat. We're already show coming up. We'll get these dogs on those fuckers. Are these guys even getting anything off? They will succumb. Seize your soul. How you doing, Kolek? Ah, he's doing fine. Get those motherfuckers! Chaos spawns have always been kind of shit as an as a unit. Go leg, get that asshole. Okay, I am not actually doing as. Well. This is not going on as well as I was hoping. Or maybe it is. What are they fighting? Oh, those guys, Premier Warriors. What about my puppies? Oh, they got those big guys beat. Get him! Look at these fuckers! Oh, this is fucking being beautiful. <laughs> Bog! <laughs> oh my god! Jesus Christ. Get him! That's gonna hurt. Oh, having those fuckers get rear end you, that's. Oof. Getting butt raped like that isn't gonna be pleasant. Seems to be doing well enough now. Yeah, I got this. Booyah! More blood for the corn! Holy hell. <laughs> oh, God. This stuff is just absolutely delicious. Well, I got quite a few cash out of that, so. Close victory. Yeah, what was there? Cha-ching, bitches. 
think the unit replenishment right now is better. Awaken tribe! Faction destroyed. Goro Madney tribe have been obliterated. There is nothing left apart from the echoing laughter of first incarnate. Best now to do a little encampment. Olaf Blum, so he's, so he's basically, okay. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna make him one, uh, one hell of a frontliner. I think that might be just the best idea. He doesn't need to be inspirational. He just beats the shit out of everything. Uh, horde upgrade. Hmm. How does that work? Marauder horsemen, chaos war wounds, chaos marauders. Oh, right. Tribal gathering. Construction slot. Okay. So that's how that works. That's something I'm going to have to get used to because I'm used to the factions are building settlements, so this is a bit different. Not much right now I can build for the rest. I'll get there. rarely emerge from under their mountains. Don't be fooled by their stunted height. They are hardy, stubborn creatures and are not to be underestimated in battle. Hmm. Okay. Oh, so that's how that works. Got it. How's the army coming? Eh, they're getting to some good... They're getting to decent strength again, but I'd like to see what else I can... Where is... There's my money being shown. Got it. <laughs> what are we getting? Marauder Horsemen. Chaos Warhounds. Chaos Marauders with great weapons. Chaos Marauder Horsemen with... Axes. How's the corruption in this place? Eh, pretty decent. Still could be better. Okay, upkeep for all units. So do does this get? Oh yeah, this gets just broken up every time you do it, isn't it? Hmm. Well, guess I could. Uh, you know what? I think I've got an idea. Let's just get this uh, trial pit up, and then afterwards, I'm gonna see if I can get myself some uh, extra units added. Gotta grow this army as big as I can, as fast as I can. Oh, okay, these are like AI armies on your side. Mm-hmm, the Winds of Magic. Trial Pit is complete. Okay, let's grow this army a little bigger. Recruits. Chaos War... Ooh, poison Chaos Warhounds. Throwing axes. So these guys would basically be armor piercing. Oh, that's going to be very handy for what's about to come up. 
Poison attacks weak against armor. Okay, so that's not really that great. Scaly skin, very fast. Vanguard deployment, very fast. Armor piercing missiles. Oh, I think I just found what I need for this, for the next, the next bunch. If we're gonna be facing dwarves, I'm gonna need some armor piercing. Scaly skin? What does that do? Jesus, this food, this dude has some abilities to his disposal. Anyway, works for me. How you doing, buddy? Alright, I'm pretty much done here. Who's this prick? Rituals of corruption performed to please the gods may see an increase in favor. Nice. Steal and destroy. Mission issued. Yeah, I know how this works. Skulls for the skull throne. Recruitment costs uh, for marauder units. The lure of dark promises. Meh. Why not? Actually, this is probably still the better option. All right, I think it's about time we start marching. So who are these guys? Are they also chaos? Oh, they're another Norska tribe, aren't they? Well, I might as well just uh, benefit from the... Well, if they're gonna just soften them up a bit for me, I might as well just... There we go. Might as well just take another turn to build up some troops and then go for the... And then we go off on our usual pillaging and raiding and, you know, all the goodness. I doubt that these guys are friends with the dwarves, so... Let's move. Hmm, or maybe I should march a bit more to the south. This would be an easy target, if I've got to be honest. Ah, fuck it, let's do it. Alright. Siege or corn? Well, is there really a. The Chaos Gods take notice of their champion, but rarely do they act in accord. Corn demands slaughter, but Siege orders a more subtle approach. What does he take me for? FOR THE BLOOD GOD! My lord, these verminous rat men are rarely seen above ground. Place no trust in their words and keep their squalid messengers at arm's length. Wait, what? Some foul contagion overtake you. The mountains fall. They gone. Now! Ooh, this could get a little tricky, though. Despoil and ravage. Storm caller. Ah, well, let's try it. That is 
takes a lot of dwarf stone. What have we got? Armor didn't shield it. Yeah, they got a lot. I'll just encircle it just a bit to soften it up. Actually, what am I saying? That's a stupid idea. FOR CORN! There is no retreat. There is only death. We're just going to have these guys flank. Just in case they have any of those ranged pricks. And we'll have one of these guys march straight to the front. Yeah, these guys don't have much in the, in the way of ranged weaponry, but it'll do. Oh god, I hate this. These guys will do their flanking. They have siege weapons. This is going to get interesting. Once they get into the thick of things, chaos doesn't go down easy, that's for sure. Cravens! Cowards! Fucking Christ. At least those siege engines are out of the picture for now. Get him, puppies! Get him! Nibble on those damn dwarves! Yeah!
Oh, these guys aren't doing anything. Halberdiers are taking quite some uh, damage from them. Where's that damned lord of theirs? Get him, Kolek! Slay him in the name of corn! Jesus, these guys are taking a beating from this. But it's still fun as hell to look at. <laughs> Jesus! Hey, Coleg! Are you sure this is fair? Your hammer's twice the size of this little bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Gravens, your warriors flee. No, not the puppies. Jesus, this keeps on going. Just keep smashing, Kolek. You can do this. You are the Sun Eater! The herald of the ruinous powers! <laughs> Fuck me, this... He is an army in and of himself! Yeah! Go leg! Still not done? That seems to be doing the trick. Come on! We got this! Their lord has rallied! 
There's no way he can take on this many fuckers. Victory is in our grasp. It's about damn time. Chaos spawns are such shitty units, to be honest. Oh, like, how you doing, buddy? Ah, you seem to be doing just fine. There we go. It's a bit tight, but eh. Pyrrhic victory. The enemy has cost you dearly. Do you even deserve it to call it a victory? Yeah, victory is victory. Blood has been spilled in the name of corn. They will blood. They will bleed and burn in the name of the ruinous powers. Judging. Look and raise, obviously. What these guys about? Karkadrak. That's their main settlement. Well, the most of the dudes survived, so. Oh, right. Skill points. Yeah, I'll give him the charge. Actually, oh, no. Uh, I'll give him some dominating presence just in case. There we go. Palmyra changed the stands re eating camp. Your following grows, mighty lord. Put your new hands to work. Have them raise new infrastructure ah. to improve your camp and Shit. further your war effort. Here's a sec. There we go. That was a small thing. Uh winter tooth and the Varg are now in a confederation. The growth of a horde is a measure of the Does this mean I can now recruit a lord? I can. What should we do? Diabolical Splendor. Tough. Should we just go... I think it's better to go for... Yeah, I'll take this guy. Suffers in the miserable conditions they find themselves, my lord. Move them on, or more warriors will fall to the elements. I'll give you some marauders for now. And we'll have him start marching down here.
What is this? Chaos Chariots, Hell Cannon, Gore Beast Chariots. What about the rest? Uh, Chaos Warriors. Already got some of those. The different sorcerers as well as the Forsaken. Chaos Trolls. Armored. Chaos Warriors with Great Weapons. Exalted Hero. And Chaos Warriors with Halberds. Chosen with Halberds. Chosen with Great Weapons. And the Chosen. Chaos Knights. Chaos Knights with Lances. Jesus. A lot of fun. That's for sure. <laughs> Need to... First course, like I said, game. Arrival power comes to parley, demanding a change in your mutual relations. Consider their offer carefully. We will have payment in valuables. Delay any longer, it will be your souls. A new. We do not negotiate. We conquer! Wait, but you're with us. Alright, you, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Since I'll be facing off against Dwarf, great weapons would probably for the, be for the best. Poison attacks. Well, I understand the concept of what that does, but... Still... Okay, we'll first march them out all the way to here, and then we'll start marching a bit more to here. And let's see how this goes. <laughs> and no. <clears throat> this is not how that works, buddy. I'm starting to understand, though, a bit better how these guys work. It's not too bad, though. Ah, yeah, now we're starting to cut some losses with it. Well, I'll get to that in a bit, but... These Chaos Warhounds wouldn't be a bad idea to have another set of them. Like I said, I'll be facing off against quite some dwarves, so armor piercing is always good. Another Chaos Marauder band wouldn't hurt, though. Okay. 
Oh, I can actually take a shortcut. But first, we got to put him into encampment as well, in camp as well, and then recruit some troops as well. That should do for now. After that, I'll start setting him up in the enemy territory and start raiding. Because as far as I understand, raiding also causes... Yeah, that's a good thing to do because we'll start generating some income again. A little bit, but hey, it's better than nothing. Hmm. This is just, I gotta say though, this is actually quite a funny Mentash. Some creep. Where did this guy come from? Call of all the gods mm, seem happy with the strength of the uh, of our sword arms. They sense weakness should we confront an arcane foe. They sent us a chaos sorcerer. Ensure he does our bidding and not the other way around. Oh, okay, so that's my hero. Got it. I'll turn this guy into a bit of a pain in the ass for the locals. I'll go for Crocodrox since that one seems to be currently a little unoccupied. Once we start getting into their territory, we'll start doing some fun. Doesn't seem to be much in the way of troops yet, so... Let's see... I'll give him one more turn to at least... Uh, fireball, Kindle Flame, all kinds of different things. Crocodrock is the main fortress, though it isn't too heavily defended, so. And if my hero can cripple their forces, I've got full reign on that city. But I'll wait just one turn just to see how that turns out. <coughs> War declared between a few factions. Yes, wars been blood. My magic is yours. Blessings of the changer. Hmm. Isn't there like a special function this guy can do? And this guy will simply be moving once he gets there. It's untainted. Blech. That that needs to be fixed. I 
I really want to see how long I can last until I get completely annihilated. All right, our AI camp starts moving, doing their own thing. Raid the lands of the enemy, mighty lord. Send your warriors out to slaughter the peasants and burn their villages. Make the enemy fear you. Are you a god? I consider myself one, but... Yep, that'll do that. Coleg, I believe you have a job to do. Is this going to be a siege, though? If that's the case, I'm just going to skip it for a bit, because... <sighs> Sieges are probably the most boring aspect of this whole damn thing. Wait, what? How are they holding me off that well? Yeah, I'm not gonna do a siege directly. That's something we're just gonna use to starve them out. Corruption. Corruption's the only way to go. Do a little bit of raiding. Next turn we'll see about causing some havoc. Skaven are making their move. Dwarves are marching. He's going back there. How's it going with the siege, buddy? Well, that's already starting to go a bit more in our direction. That's good. Where's that hero of mine? There we go. Damn it, that's not great. Free, how many turns? Five. Damn it. Okay, first I'm gonna actually put him in an encampment. Because I do need a few more troops. There we go. I do need to start slaughtering again because I'm... Uh, my finances is going into the negative and that's never a good thing. Skaven. Hmm. Alright. Let's see how this goes.
Let's see what is Skaven gonna do? Fine with me. They wreck it. I slaughter them. Or isn't his army supposed to be crippled? Hey, 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 what the hell do you think you're going, buddy? That could at least weaken him a bit. Still, I'm gonna continue on sieging that city of his. Declare war. Let's see how this goes. Because it says that we're pretty evenly matched, but I want to see if that's actually true. Hold control while right clicking and dragging out a formation to walk into specified positions. Hold all them. Okay. I might need to keep that in mind. Hmm. Not much else to it. All right, let's do this. Where are those damned rats? There they are. Come on, dude! Hurry it up, man! You gotta hit the gym! Damn it, I forgot about the pups.
You ain't escaping from that, you uh, motherfuckers. I like the pops. They're not bad. Jesus. I'll have them keep uh, harassing those guys. Yeah, this is Skaven, all right. All that fucking warp magic of theirs. It's just that one damned rat. But he won't go down! The rest is just standing there, you know. Get him, puppies! <laughs> nope. <laughs> Close victory. Eh. Victory is a victory. <laughs> it worked. Close victory. Still a victory a vic is a victory. Wailing banner. Rank gained. Total favor. Beast men. They're in this place as well, huh? Yeah, uh, like I said, sieges are not the most interesting thing, so I'm just skipping that. And these dwarves know how to do this. So I'm pretty much out of turns right now. These fuckers are not having a good day either, so I don't have to worry too quickly about them. He's taking seriously ca serious casualties. Yeah, I know. I was maybe open for. All right. I had a feeling he would make a run for it. He's making a line for my fucking... Who the hell is this dude?
<laughs> they just keep chasing him. <laughs> Get back here, you little fucker! Yeah, that was to be expected. But he has been severely harmed because of that. There we go, a little bit of decrease in troop. Might as well do some raiding, because I'm not taking this just yet. Maybe I should have gone for this one. Jesus fucking why does this always take so goddamn long? And it still has an advantage. I refuse to charge. They got way too many of that those craps. They got long beards, they got a fane, they got quarrelers, they got thunderers. There's no way that I'm going to get through all that with these troops. I will serve, I will spill blood for corn, but not at the expense, mostly at the expense of my own forces. I'm not that big of an idiot. In the meantime, I should probably grow the troops here a little bit. There we go. More marauders. Let's see what they do. A hero is going to do some things. Not going to be too worried about that. That dwarf ain't going to be doing shit. I'm gonna wreck that house of his. <laughs> um, no. How's this going? Ugh. There is no way I can make my way through that. You know what, I'm gonna save, and I'm gonna see if I can actually see the damn thing. As much as I hate it. <sighs> I don't like siege battles, they're boring, but I'll do it for now. Don't know how long I'll be streaming though. 
It's already one hour, an hour and twenty minutes, so. The siege weapons are ready, my lord. Deploy them against the enemy so we can see them in action. Um. Oh, okay, I see him. Do I have a battering ram? I do. I have two battering rams. We'll set them over here. And the rest can just stay on this side and make for the front. Let's see how this goes. The siege weapons are in position, my lord, and they're ready to begin their assault. Begin your advance. The shackles attack. Kolak is already beating on that damn door. Jeez, fucking Christ, he's in I don't like this though. Damn thing is so slow. Now we're talking. This is such a boring part of this whole thing. The heart of the city is within sight, my lord. Press forward. Crack 
crap. That's what I'm talking about. Jesus. Okay, this was the better option anyway. Get him! Cross that little fucker! Come on! Do it! Boom! General is slain, my lord, cursing your name with his dying breath. Send his army after him. Yep. <laughs> this wasn't going to end well for these dwarves. A decisive victory. So I don't know what that bar was trying to show, but it seems I had the advantage. <laughs> Stupid dwarves thinking they can beat me. No one can stop the ruin of the world. The end times are near for corn. Um, blue and raise for now. Never hurts to have some of that. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. Corruption is spreading. That's good. I need some new units for this bunch. Now we can do this. I'm in
Chaos Giants, Dragon there are the big guys I was hoping to get my hands on at some point. Yeah, these guys aren't much in the way of building anyway. But this, this is also nice. <laughs> well, I'm at least making some progress. This guy will do whatever he does right now. Rating should at least have some advantages. Well, he's already recruited. But I might as well add a few more. Actually, I think it's best to set him in rating for now. I don't think you can actually go through here, so I'll just have to make my way into the lands, but I need more troops. There we go, just a little bit more. Then I'll start raiding it maybe a bit. This place though, this could be a problem. Swordsmen, spearmen with shields, crossbowmen. That's quite a number. I need to make my move on it. Although oh, help it. Oof. That's quite an army. I think it might actually be better to first take care of the places around it before I make my move on the main settlement. Colex Sun Eater will be of course moving in as well. We still have this little but I don't know who this guy is, but you better get the hell out of here. I do not need this kind of bullshit. And I do not appreciate anyone who does that. So, Doc, suppose I'm giving you one thing. I know it's just a bot account, but make this clear. Take that shit to someone who actually buys it. I don't. I don't want to see that shit in my chat again. Or, by God, I will find a way to kill you. Hmm. Huh. No. For only 200 gold? Not worth it. You better be offering a little bit more than that, little guy. Little green man. You're gonna... Hmm. Ballsy. I'll give it that. Don't worry, you're about to get some backup anyway. Okay, that one's got an army in it, so I should just go for Fort Straggle for now. You might not want to be here, buddy. Because it's about to go. This is going to end poorly for you. All right, let's see what else is up. Clan Mulder is making its move. Oh boy. Hmm. It says that I'm going to lose, but let's try it anyway. He's got some crossbowmen, and by the looks of it, it's, um, 
one little bit of cavalry, but I think I can have, I can do some good damage against him. Let's see here. Well, we're chaos. We don't run away. We just charge straight. Dude, what the hell is up with that helmet of yours? <laughs> Jesus. Dogs will eventually come back, I know. You can't outrun these puppies. Prepare to be mauled, you fuckers! He's in the thick of things. Get him, boys! Get him! My puppies! Where are my puppies? Puppies? No! My puppies have been killed! And another bunch are fleeing again. Oh, they've got guns. Yeah, that's gonna be a little tricky. Skulls for the skull throne!
Yeah, the Chaos aren't really much in high technology. They just prefer to do it the old-fashioned way. How you doing, buddy? Jesus. Well, the puppies are all dead by the looks of it. He's still having fun, though. Yeah, they have way too many missile units for me to handle. Not the Chaos's strongest suit. But I'm making them work for it. Yeah. I'm making them fight for it though. Get him, boys! You can have the eyes and everything else along with it. I'm surprised that they still keep going. Holy crap. Gravens. Valiant defeat. Yep, that's what I won through. If I was going to go down, I was going to make sure they go down with me. Puppies are actually still alive, they just flip the battlefield. That's what you get with puppies that tend to charge ahead a little too much. <sighs> killed in battle. Surely a cruel just for the gods. Ventures have been killed in the battle for at Fort Ostro Ostrosk. Northern Oblast. Damn it. Well, back to Kolag then. That's how it goes. Blood for the blood god. He doesn't care whose blood it is. He's back though. Booyah. <laughs> He's gonna have trouble from both sides, so that works out for me. Oh, I can always get a new one, but let's first do some let's first have some fun. Uh, 
Oh, uh, this time... Oh, that's a hero. No, don't you fucking dare on me, you... Hmm. Got like blo blood gorge. I'm not giving you much of a choice, buddy. That's the target I'm looking for. Ah, you. I'll first build up. I'm first gonna try and get rid of these dwarves before I start bringing in, an, in another lord. Don't know what that lump. Uh, okay, for one guy, it's—I mean, it's just him. I'm not gonna be that much. I'm not gonna be that cruel. Come on. I'll let them have their fun there. All right, I think it's actually best now to recruit a lord. Let's just do this. I'm going to keep it encircled for now. Let's see, what is now a good option to go with? The Sun Eater, holy sh... <laughs> Let's see here, there are so many options. I'll take one point in Ruination for now. We'll just let him do his thing.
There is an army this time, so we're gonna have to do this the fun way. In the underway, huh? Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> the enemy used the forests to conceal their movements, my lord. Approach with caution. Yeah, the dogs are not very good for this kind of situation. Get him, Coleg! Get him! Save the puppies! Save the puppies! Boom! Did I see some troops in the ba in the back line? Stupid rats! I am the exterminator. Yeah, this wasn't too difficult. <laughs> this is what chaos does, you dipshits. Slaughter in the name of the chaos gods. For the ruinous powers! Kill captives, yeah, these guys don't take prisoners.
Okay, so we're gonna have to start recruiting a little bit. That requires, of course, a little bit of money, but that's not a problem. Both global and local this time, because I'm gonna be needing it. Where's he going? No! There is no agreement, there is no peace with these guys. Only the slaughter. Right, these two should never be close to one another. That's what I forgot. These two should never be close to one another. Once these have been built, I'll start moving them out. I forgot chaos soldiers should chaos army should never remain close to one another. That was it. Oh, the little fucker's gonna be ruining in my little camps, huh? Come on, Crumb. I'll let the AI army pummel a little bit on them. Now we can do this properly. Just a little bit more. I want to at least wreck this before I end the stream for now.
Uh, now he's going back. I was hoping he was maybe going to be some additional reinforcements. Okay, for that I will just because I can see some advantages in that. Once this is done, okay, I need a bit more than that. That should do for now. Oh, it's just miners. What am I? What the hell am I so afraid of? I've got a few dwarf warriors, but it's mostly just absolutely nothing. For some reason, though, it's still sh ah, screw it. Let's. <laughs> you know what? One more because they were about to take some serious. That can't be good. <laughs> These are probably past each other by as if it's nobody's business. I'm just gonna go down the line with this. One more encirclement. Alright, I really need to start getting some uh, wrecking shit done because...
Where is that guy going? Okay, I don't know what the hell this AI is doing, but it just keeps going back and forth, back and forth. <sighs> Fine for now, for now. I'll turn on the Beastman eventually. Let's hope this turns out well enough. Should be good. Now my lord is under attack, that's the point. That means he's in combat, that's a good thing. Slaughter these fools in the name of corn.
Victory! Corn will be pleased! For corn. <laughs> Excellent. Not the most amount of money, but Yeah, we need some money right now, so Follower gain, demagogue. I don't need your faith, only your obedience. Yep. Now I know for sure I'm going to win this battle. <laughs> Those miners are not in tip top shape. Quite frankly, I don't give a damn. Okay, so it seems to be a pretty even field.
Jesus. Jesus Christ! Once these things start wrecking in these fuckers, there you go, wrecking. Shagos are having their fun with the hero, or with the lord. Look at these fuckers. Jesus, Cole, calm the fuck down. It's just one dwarf. <laughs> Holy hell. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that wasn't a good run for them. <laughs> now that's a good amount of money. Raise it. Surplus is coming along eventually. I need to get rid of these fuckers. Can I do it on this guy? Nope. Like Sun Eater, of course, has gotten another point. But I think I'll leave it here for now. This is fun. To be honest, Chaos is more fun than I was expecting it to be. But I wanted to try and awaken another tribe. But that might require me to go in here. Wouldn't hurt. Cola could just continue marching down here. And I'll have these guys for the moment. Or at least this guy have his fun around here. 
But I'll leave it here for now, and I'll definitely continue on for this in the future because this could get very fun. Maybe even tomorrow. Me, maybe. Nah, 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 nah. Until then, I hope you guys have a good evening. And for anyone who tuned in, thank you for viewing. And anyone who dares to do anything along the chat that is trying to advertise for any sort of way to buy followers, primes, views, and anything, do yourself a favor and get a job. Because I'm not buying that shit. Or try with someone else. I'm sure there's some Twitch chick that probably would do it in a heartbeat. I'm not that guy. Till then. Have a good evening. And I'll see you guys until next time. And remember. Blood for the blood god. And skulls for the skull throne.